Hey everybody and welcome to the video. Today we're going to be making one of my favorites, roasted spaghetti squash with meat sauce. This meal works really well as a lower calorie option when you're craving traditional spaghetti, but you're maybe not able to fit a big bowl of spaghetti into your daily calories. This always gives me that same great comfort food feeling without breaking my diet. I hope you all enjoy. Be sure to like the video if you did and subscribe if you'd like to see more. We're going to start by preheating your oven to 375 degrees Fahrenheit or 190 degrees Celsius. Cut the spaghetti squash into halves, but make sure you have a good knife as it can be very difficult. Deseed the squash and salt and pepper both halves. Apply a light coating of cooking spray and bake for about 45 minutes or until the squash is fork tender. While these are cooking in the oven, it's time to brown our ground beef and make our meat sauce. I prefer to use 93.7 ground beef for this, but you're welcome to use whichever type of meat or lack of that you enjoy. Ground turkey or sliced chicken breast also work very well with this dish. If you're feeling ambitious, you can make your own marinara sauce, but I'm going to be keeping it simple and using a store-bought jar. Once the meat is browned and you've added in the sauce, you'll want to set this aside for when the spaghetti squash is finished. When you're taking these out of the oven, they will be extremely hot. Be sure to let them cool and protect your hands. But once they're cooled, you'll want to take your fork and lightly scrape the inside of the squash, turning it into spaghetti noodle-like strands. Just top the squash with the meat sauce and a bit of mozzarella, then finish them in the oven to melt the cheese. And that is it. This recipe comes out to about 400 calories per half for a giant portion of what is basically spaghetti. Whether it's for a home cooked dinner with the family or your weekly meal prep, you'll have to be sure to give this one a try. Full ingredient list and amounts are in the description box, but until next time, I'll talk to you all later. Have a good one.